Yo, what up, Nick? And welcome to What the Heck is This, you might ask. Okay, so I'm in the Philippines, right? And this game is very popular. I don't play it anymore. Well, that's a lie. I just started playing it again this month. Long story short, when I was a kid, I used to play this a lot because it's popular here. And it still is. I haven't played it for two years. The only reason I'm making this video is because of the new hero, Savior. I will burn down everything they stand for. Ah! Before you comment, what kind of build is he got, bro? <laughs> I already said it in the intro. I don't play this game that much. Also, I'm not a mage user. The only mage I use is Veil. So if you think I suck, keep it to yourself. Look at this, I had a lose streak. I had to win consecutively to make this video to be confident of myself. So this is a lot for me. Okay, let's just start the video. I'm gonna play classic only because I don't want to risk him getting banned. Look at all these weebs. Look at that. These people are definitely joining the couples. And this dude's depressed. My emblem? I made this today. This is the reason why I won earlier. It's nothing special. I aimed for cooldown reduction, magic penetration, and you guys can read the last one. I don't even know what it is, to be honest. I think it does more damage. This is my build. I went for the cooldown build. I tried the burst one. That's why I kept losing because I was experimenting. And it wasn't for me. It didn't fit my gameplay, basically. You can use flame shot, but I rather use flicker because it doesn't really have any mobility skills. Except if you count his second skill, which isn't really much of a mobility anyway. Oh crap, they have a fanny. But if they're good, then we're effed. But that is fine. Because we're gonna win this, I hope. Okay, so here we are. As per usual, we go to the mid lane. Okay, so I have a bad habit of going to this bush, I'm gonna be honest. You don't have to do this for this hero. It's because I use Veil, alright? But you can just stay at the tower and just use his first skill. So his first skill basically goes further the more enemy you hit. So the range isn't that big, but if you hit an enemy consecutively, then it will continue to go forward or farther, I mean. I promise I passed English. So, ah, sucks. Okay, so as you saw there, okay, they're fun. They're fun. They're funny sucks. What? This is nice. So as you can see, I used a combo there, I'm gonna explain it later, and she got away. That's fine. See? I used it again. So that combo is first skill and second skill. So, quick explanation. Xavier's second skill basically slows the enemy down. If you go through it, it increases your movement speed. But the other thing is, if you place the second skill and hit it with your first, it then makes every enemy or minions or jungles that step to the circle immobilize. So what I basically do is that instead of using the second skill first and then the first skill, I do it the opposite way but do it faster so that the immobility effect goes quicker. Keep in mind that this will only work if you remember that the second skill is on cooldown. Which I definitely knew I didn't just tap my first skill not knowing that I didn't have my second skill ready. I did that on purpose to scare Hanabi. Okay, my goal for this at the moment is to clear this lane and also to continually poke their Hanabi. That sounds weird, that in a weird way. I'm gonna recall because I don't have mana. Don't worry, late game, his mana won't be a problem. Trust the process. Okay, this Hanabi is kind of getting annoying. I think I can't kill her yet, so I might as well help somebody out. Seeing that the top lane only has Veil on it, Veil is very squishy, he's a squishy boy. So I'm gonna be going there to help assist this, uh, how do you say his name? Almond? <laughs> Psych! Yes, I definitely assisted there, did not steal anything whatsoever. You know what, I feel bad, so I'm gonna help you with this crab monster, dude. Okay, you did it. Now let's do the tor 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 what? <laughs> okay, we're all here, we're squad, I guess. Uh, I don't know why the enemy didn't notice that we all are missing, but I guess that works out for us. And I'm riding you for some reason. This is bad, okay. Uh, I don't have mana, so I'm gonna recall now. I guess not. What was I thinking back then? Okay, I'm stronger now. I can take Hanabi. But I see that Franco is fighting an enemy. So me and Moscow are gonna have a competition and I won. So I did that legitly. Legit is all I have. Legit is my middle name. Once we destroy their hearts, we destroy their towers. So I'm gonna be pushing this to get coins. This is probably a bad idea because I don't have flicker. 
And good call by me because I knew the enemy was there. The only problem was that I couldn't do anything about it. So I ran away. Oh look, there are Goshen's here. So let's see, mage versus mage, who's better? Um, I could have killed him here, but I didn't have my ultimate and because I was stupid, I didn't chase him. So I was just standing in front of this turret while this fanic kept harassing my Franco. Such a waste! No! Thank you! Come on. Yes! Thank you, Franco. Thank you. So here I am, having a dance party with Franco. We showed each other our appreciation, I helped my almond out. Did not try to kill Steel, I promise. I see Hanabi always wants to be with me, so I take that as a sign that she is fond with me. That also means that I want to destroy and kill her. Though we are winning, the problem of this game is that they could probably come back based on their heroes alone. They have lots of more. I take that back, she is getting destroyed, and she is dead. So moments like this are the moments where I naturally shine. I assist them, I don't kill Steel. And look at that! I bet he's happy now. Then I go back to my lane, clear some up. Johnson casually rants over my minions. That's fine. So since everybody is killing each other, I'm gonna go help Johnson. There it is. He said he wanted help, so I'm gonna go there. Even if he didn't want to, to be honest. I'm just gonna hide in the bush. I think the enemy is on the bush too. If Johnson just hits him. Yep, he's doing it. <laughs> okay, and... Then she doesn't die. Nice. Go on. <laughs> I just turned into a gremlin. Okay, there. Perfect. Nice. <laughs> you suck. So as you can see from my reaction, I was extremely happy. Screaming, you suck in front of the enemy. Don't. He died. Okay, so I don't know what you're doing, Johnson. Is this for me or... Regardless of the answer, I still took it anyway. Their fan, he really likes to harass our tanks. And it's annoying because she keeps getting away. Franco, I meet you again. Oh, you want to kill Fanny? We have a lot in common, I guess. So we are all here to kill this annoying Fanny. And then, then please don't tell me she doesn't, she doesn't die. Nice. <laughs> ah, my bad. I see Moscow is having trouble. Let the real sniper take care of this. And I think I uh <laughs> wait he died how I guess that was my passive on my uh emblem I just wasted a flicker there easy PG level squeeze he died oh they traded lives yeah I can give this to you hello and oh crap. <laughs> He got, he got me. That was a nice set. So because of that, my confidence went from 100 to 0 real quick. Looks like my team are doing better for themselves. Maybe they don't even need me. But I don't really care about that because I'm a killjoy. So I'm gonna go there anyway and kill all their stuff and steal them all. See, with cooldown build, I can just spam this ult now. You might say, ah, oh, that's kind of reckless. No, it's not. That's the point. What the heck? Vale kept attacking this bush, so I'm gonna attack it also because maybe it's a mutual enemy. I don't know what he's doing. Okay, so I'm just gonna be... Okay, I see Vale, I see Vale. I see Vale. I see Vale. Hello? I beg your pardon? Gosh, how did he... How did he... Nice. Nice. How did I survive that? Look at the cooldown! may not be good, at least I'm not super bad. <laughs> Kill it! Kill! Yes! I messed up there. Okay, he's come for me. What? Are you serious? Okay, so how are we gonna... How are we gonna do this? Nobody saw that. Guys, what are you doing? How is this happening? What? Bruh. Okay, I don't know why we're doing Lord at Classic, but I immediately regret it. 
Victory, please! You guys, are you serious? Look at us, sniper boys working together. That's that's new. And then uh, our sniper boy got snatched, so I'm gonna go help him. Well, he can help himself, I guess. What? Okay, this is fine. You know what? There. I'll help you out. I don't think I hit. <laughs> I suck so much. Don't die, guys. You're my only hope. Oh my gosh, nice. And pop! I didn't kill Steel, I just secured it. Also, Franco approves. What more do you want? <laughs> what are you doing, bro? So, as Vale is busy protecting the main turret, I'm gonna push the top. Oh, I guess Johnson will join me too. I noticed that Cyclops was still alive, so I ran away because I didn't want to die. And I think I died. I didn't! I'm a legend! Our teammates are getting kills, so I'm gonna support that. Also gonna use my ultimate on this and I hope he get it and he does not. That's fine. That was close, he got a triple kill. I'm looking at the enemies, I'm really looking for that soft boy. No no no. I'm gonna wait for the right time. Like that. Huh? And yep, he uh Sniper boy, we are making it hard to be friends with. <laughs> Even Franco was confused. <laughs> we did it! Okay. I didn't get to be on the final screen. That's fine. And look at that. We did it. Easy peasy. They had AFK, never mind. Just pretend that's a gold. And that is it. Hope you liked that Xavier gameplay. Not that good. You could probably tell. Also, I hope you like this style of video. Like, my voice is gone right now. I've been narrating for so long. It's 5 a.m. I surprisingly had really good fun. But anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, pound the subscribe button like you want it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.